I would like to thank the City of Rome, the Admiral John H. Towers Memorial Committee, and the Rome Area Heritage Foundation for their support and assistance in the creation and dedication of the Admiral John Towers Historic Marker. I would especially like to thank Howie, the chairman of the Admiral John H. Towers Memorial Committee. The process to erect a historical marker can be long and arduous. It goes through many edits, many people view it, and Howie took it in stride. And if you know Howie, he keeps you laughing along the way, so it's been an absolute pleasure. As chief of the Bureau of Aeronautics, 1939 through 1942, Towers organized naval air aircraft procurement prior to and during World War II. Later, he served as Commander-in-Chief Pacific Fleet, a Navy Cross and Navy Distinguished Service Medal recipient. Towers was the first career aviator, uh, naval aviator to reach flag rank. He is buried in Arlington National Cemetery, excuse me, erected by the Georgia Historical Society, City of Rome, and the Rome Area Heritage Foundation. Today we dedicated a new historical marker for Admiral John H. Towers, and this is part of the Georgia Historical Marker Program. We've erected over 200 markers across the state, and this, uh, the marker behind me is significant not only to Rome, um, Admiral John H. Towers, this is actually his birthplace, uh, the site of his birthplace. And not only is he significant to Rome, not only is he significant to the state, but he's also He's significant to the country. He is somebody who had foresight into bringing naval aviation or aviation into the Navy, into the United States military before World War II.